Hello everyone, Sean Mancine here, and today I'm continuing my series on Untangle. Um, today I'm speaking about how to change your speed and duplex settings to match the speed and duplex settings of your router. So, um, I have a Cisco router connected to my Untangle box, which I'm going to log into right now. And so if I if I check my speed and duplex, I am set to speed auto uh, duplex auto. So I may want to change this to um, <clears throat> I may want to change this to hard coded. Let's say 100 full. As a matter of fact, that was my WAN inter. That's a WAN interface. So uh, here's my LAN interface. I'm actually set to 100 full here so I'd want to uh, go ahead and match those settings on my untangle box and I also want to match my MTU size <coughs> as well so uh, because I haven't set any other MTU so on this it's going to be default of 1500 so to change your speed and duplex settings you're going to click on config go down to network And now under interfaces, you're going to see uh, your external and internal. Um, you're going to see your external and internal devices. Okay. You'll want to go over to advanced. Then click network cards. Okay. <clears throat> this is for demonstration. I already have mine set, of course. Um, but what you'll do is for MTU, you can leave it to auto unless you've enabled jumbo frame. Then you'll put in your jumbo frame MTU value. So if it's 9212 or 9000, you'll just enter that info into the MTU field. And then for your duplex setting, you'll just click on your click on the box here and click on the drop down menu. And then you'll see all the speed and duplex settings that are uh, associated with your particular network card. So for me, my uh, network card uh, supports, uh, it's for this box is a gigabit network card. So I can only go up to 1000 full. Uh, for some reason, I do notice, uh, it's a, I think it's a bit of a bug here, but it does uh, even allow you showing like 10 gig full and 10 gig half. Um, and I've actually tried it and it does apply without even giving a warning uh, which then knocks on the interface so um, I don't know if that's a bug or if that's there by design so anyways you'll select the 100 full on your interfaces then you simply click apply and there's nothing to apply here so it's not going to really do anything and uh, there you go uh, you'll have your your set to 100 full. How you can verify this uh, in the command line, just to be sure, you can log into your Untangle box via the command line. Okay. And then just do if config. Okay. And then you're going to look for uh, the physical interfaces, not the bridged. But the physical interfaces, okay. So you'll see in this case we'll see the MTU of 1500, okay. And now if we want to see the speed and duplex, just do me dash tool, okay. And uh, the me tool will say the Ethernet zero and Ethernet one are both 100 megabit full duplex, okay. And again, just to just to be sure. Um, the IF config will be able to say that our MTU is set to 1500. The ME tool is to check your speed and duplex settings uh, to make sure that what you applied in the GUI is showing up in the actual settings. So that's it for this video. Uh, I still continue, uh, I'm still going to continue on my series on uh, Untangle and cover as many aspects of this uh, awesome firewall as possible. Uh, if you have any comments or suggestions, please do leave them in the uh, comment section below. Please visit my website, uh, Sean Man no, Sean Mancini dot com. Okay. 
Uh, and again, thanks for watching, everyone. Have a great day.